Hello everyone and welcome to Flaming Azurite Studios. It has been a really long time since I have made a screencast and in today's screencast we will see how to install Drupal 7.12 using WAMP server on Windows. Installing Drupal is very similar to installing WordPress but it is very people find it difficult to install Drupal because it is the installation is kind of buggy. Uh, if you install it in Google Chrome, it might work, and if you install it in Firefox, it might work, and it might not work in all the three browsers, and it might not work in on your whole system, but it will perfectly work on a Unix system. There are a lot of things. It all depends on your luck, and yeah, let's get started. Uh, to install Drupal 7.12 or any Drupal, as a matter of fact, you need to start the you need to create a database first. So for that, you have to start your WAMP server. Yes. And go to your tray and then click on the WAMP server icon. Then click on PHP My Admin. Your default browser will open and your PHP My Admin will get loaded. Then click on databases. Create a new database. I'll call my Drupal database as Drupal um, underscore um, database. Yes. Okay. Database is too long. I'll just put DB. Drupal underscore DB. Create. Um, yeah. One thing you have to uh, do now is go to click on the underscore DB or Drupal underscore DB, whatever. And. Uh, go to privileges and click on edit privileges of root go to login information and in the password just put no password then click on go and similarly do to the other two areas no password go and now edit privileges of root local host no password go mm, that's it over you have created successfully created the database without any password uh, you definitely need a password when you are doing it uh, on a server or a remote server but if since this is just a local installation I really don't see the point in having a password not only me most of the guys don't actually use a password now here is my Drupal 7.1.2 zip file. Mm, double click on it and then yeah these are the contents of this particular zip file. Select all, control A, extract to local disk C, WAMP, www and create a new directory. It's called shift okay mm, if everything goes well went well I should be able to see my Drupal directory mm, yeah everything is here and remember this dot ht access file is very 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 important so make sure that it is there in your Drupal installation Drupal file folder if you have extracted everything properly it should be I'm going to open my Firefox browser. There is a reason for that. And I'll explain it later. Yeah. Sorry for that. Mm. I'll go to my local host. And then I'll go to my Drupal page. Drupal directory and you should be getting something like this if you have not installed Drupal before just put standard and save click on save and continue English is only the language built in so you have no other unless you want to install it in some other language then you can press follow this link save and continue yeah now depending on your database if you are using WAM that is then it is definitely MySQL so 
don't bother but if you are actually using some other database then it is then press SQLite and I remember it was Drupal underscore DB database username is root and password name is nothing save and continue and just wait for the installation to finish you will be getting a screen like this which says initializing and uh, uh, a status bar appears just wait for all the modules to get finished installed all the modules got successfully installed uh, there is this hundred percent thing and now uh, this is the final thing just put my drupal mm, just write some uh, username is just I'm going my initials here yeah, password is give a strong password So it should match some hints are given here like you need to make your password stronger you have to add uppercase letters add some punctuations it's up to you just your put in your country name minus India time zone and hit on save and continue not now voila you have finished everything and uh, here is your brand new Drupal site. Thanks for watching guys. See you next time.